Zach Alberti from the Gainesville Sun here with Florida wide receiver commit Ahmad Fullwood. Uh, he just wrapped up his regular season with Bishop Kenny as they defeated West Nassau 21-7. Uh, he told me it was his third uh, night where he in his high school career where he was held scoreless, but you know, he still made some catches for his team to help with the win. Uh, I'm going to just talk about your performance tonight and what it was like to uh, you know, end, end your high school career with that victory at home. Um, I mean, it was more important to uh, me playing on defense more than playing on offense. I mean, we knew we were going to score at ease, you know, because our, our offense is lethal, but it was more stopping the opposing team, you know, and, and just making plays on defense. So, you know, I had to come down from safety and, and make a few hits. Now, you play offense, defense, and special teams. You're the punt returner, kick returner. Uh, talk about what that's like to kind of be on the field at all times and, and be counted on that heavily by your team. I mean, I, I don't look at it as, you know, that much pressure. I, I look at it as, you know, my team needs me to make a play, and, and I want to be there to make that play. So, I mean, they put me in the best position every week, you know, to give me the opportunity to make those plays. Now, uh, how, do you, how do you feel that you've done this season overall as far as uh, improvements that you, you know, I know you said you wanted to make? From the summer and all the camps that you got to do that carry over to this season. Oh, I mean, it's carried over great. I mean, uh, it's it's more been a, from a team aspect than you know just an uh, individual aspect. You know, yeah, I, I got my game up, but um, you know, more of like being a leader on the on the in the locker room. You know, um, leading guys, leading the younger ones. You know, because they're gonna have to take over the dynasty after I leave. <laughs> now to discuss Florida a little bit. Uh, I know you've been out there a bunch this year. I think you've been to every home game. Um, just talk about your impressions of the Gators this year and the, and the job Will Muschamp's done in 2012. I mean, the Gators have done more expected than anybody would ever thought. I mean, I knew we were going to be lethal this year. I knew we were going to be crazy good. But, I mean, m most fans would have thought, you know, we would have came out with like a 10-2 and two season. But, I mean, we're, we're right there trying to get into the SEC championship right now, you know, and, and make a national championship run. All right. Now, talk about your impressions of Florida's offense with Brent Pease and, and the job he's been able to do this year. <laughs> Me and Coach Pease talk a lot, and all I can say is um, the, the best is yet to come. I mean, I'm not saying, you know, 2013 class is, is going to, you know, bring, bring some, uh, you know, some different stuff, but Coach Pease has definitely got some plan for the playmakers we got coming up and the playmakers that are staying there, you know, get some, get some, just some ballers on the field at all times. I mean, it's going to be crazy. Now, speaking of playmakers, I know we've talked about it before, but uh, Florida hasn't had a, a top 100 receiver that was 6'4 or taller in a long time. You know, what does it feel like to kind of be a guy that can come in and set that new standard um, and, and bring some new things to Florida's offense? I mean, I try not to look at it like that. You know, I try to look at it like I'm, I'm the first in a while. I just try to look at it, you know, I was given an opportunity to go play for the University of Florida, and I'm going to take advantage of it. All right, and, and, and speaking of, you know, the opportunity, you know, Florida hasn't done, been able to do too much in the passing game this year, but you know, what do you think that you can bring uh, next year when you come in as a freshman uh, to help Jeff Driscoll and, and all, you know, all the other receivers out in the passing game? Uh, I mean, I, I just you know want to spread the field. I mean, I want I want another weapon on the field. That, you know, another defense has to worry about. Um, I'm, not, I'm not saying at all that they don't have the weapons right now. The, the receivers are now doing an excellent job, uh, but I just want to you know make an impact on, on the deep threat. So now they got another person to worry about, so we can get uh, you know the slot receivers and a running back, you know, give them some space to, you know, work with.